हेलो एवरीवन सो इस लेक्चर में हम लोग सीक्वेंशियल क्राइटेरियन ऑफ लिमिट पॉइंट्स ऑफ अ सेट डिफाइन करेंगे तो देखिए इसमें हमारे पास जो लिमिट पॉइंट ऑफ अ सेट है ये बहुत अच्छी तरह से क्लियर होना चाहिए किसी भी कॉन्सेप्ट में पूरी रियल एनालिसिस में हम सबसे ज्यादा यूज जो करने वाले हैं दैट इज अ लिमिट पॉइंट ऑफ अ सेट और लिमिट पॉइंट ऑफ अ सीक्वेंस और लिमिट ऑफ द सीक्वेंस दीज थ्री टर्म्स आर वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट ओके तो ये हमारे ये हमें बिल्कुल क्लियर होना चाहिए अब हम जो मैंने लिमिट पॉइंट जो मैंने पढ़ाया है उसमें मैंने दो लेक्चर लिए हैं लिमिट पॉइंट के जिसमें मैंने एक डेफिनेशन पहली डेफिनेशन बताया है और दूसरे लेक्चर में मैंने डेफिनेशन टू बताया ये दोनों ही डेफिनेशन बड़ी इंपॉर्टेंट है क्वेश्चन को आराम से करने के लिए विथ यूजिंग कॉन्सेप्ट ये दोनों डेफिनेशन बहुत इंपॉर्टेंट है तो इसका लेक्चर आप लोग सुन लीजिएगा और कोई प्रॉब्लम हो तो हम लोग कमेंट में डिस्कस कर सकते हैं बट रिलेटेड टू द कंटेंट ऑफ द वीडियो ऑल राइट सो अब हम सीक्वेंशियल क्राइटेरियन देखते हैं तो इसके पहले हम सीक्वेंस डिफाइन कर लेते हैं तो सीक्वेंस सो अ सीक्वेंस ऑन आर रिमेंबर दैट वी आर टॉकिंग अबाउट द रियल नंबर सिस्टम अ सीक्वेंस ऑन आर इज इज अ मैप एफ From n to r, all right. Remember, one whenever you define a sequence, then the domain should be a set of natural number, and the co-domain should be a because we are defining the sequence on the real numbers. Therefore, it is a real number. Okay. If it is a complex, then I will use the complex as co-domain. All right. So n to r now such that f n is equal to for n belongs to natural number. a n my formula just i will use the general formula here to define the sequence so i will make this one a simple diagram arrow diagram this is a set of natural number and this is a set of real numbers okay so set of natural number will contain 1 2 3 and so on so what is my fn f of n is equal to a n for n belongs to natural number it means that for each natural number you will get the term of the sequence all right so for one my a1 will be there a2 will be there for two a3 will be there for three and so on up to an will we get we will get an for n okay so i will give you two three examples so fn is equal to an it means that f1 so my terms of the sequence is what i will denote the sequence by this arrow that the term of the sequence is f1 f2 f of 3 and so on because it is a map so it is easy to understand so this is a sequence okay so for sequence i will use this notation and for set i will use the curly braces so my f1 is what it is a1 f2 is what a2 a3 and so on up to an and so on up to it will go okay it will contain several naturally the infinite number of elements so right now if i will produce one example for example this is very famous example 1 over n and another example for example i selected bn that is i this one because these two example from these two example i will clear many things so first example is an so i will write in this way 1 because for n is equal to n belongs to natural number 1 1 by 2 1 by 3 and so on so these are the terms of the sequence so my range set will include all these points 1 1 by 2 1 by 3 and so on because it does not repeat any element so i have no problem so in the case this one bn this will be located as minus 1 1 minus 1 1 and so on now look at the what is the range set of this sequence range of bn is equal to what it will include only minus 1 and 1 because because the ra range is a set therefore range range set therefore it will not repeat any element so only minus 1 and 1 will be there it means that in the sequence the elements may repeat all right so i have no problem with this now i will define the sequential criterion of limit point of a set तो सीक्वेंशियल क्राइटेरियन डिफाइन करने के लिए हमें क्या करना हमें बस ये चेक करना है कि कोई भी पॉइंट गिवन कोई भी पॉइंट हो जो आप सोच पाए कि वो लिमिट पॉइंट है कि नहीं है तो जस्ट यू कैन यूज दिस कॉन्सेप्ट ओके सो विल डिफाइन अ पॉइंट 
a point x belongs to r real numbers is a limit point of any set s subset of r if and only if there exist a sequence there exists a sequence the notation is an in s set mein hona chahiye kyunki hum is set ka limit point ko check karne ja rahe hain therefore i will select the sequence from the set okay such that such that an is equal not equal to x for all n belongs to natural number an should not be equal to x this restriction is very important if you don't focus on this restriction the problem may be incorrect all right you can make the errors in the problem so and and one more thing that limit n tends to infinity an should be equal to x all right so jo bhi hum question karte the ab jaise maan lijiye humne example liya to criteria nahi kehti hai if and only if statement hai that is a very important thing and very good thing about this theorem that it is a statement of if and only so there exists a sequence in s such that an is not equal to x but an tends to x as n tends to infinity all right so if i take one example that is 1 over n that is a very famous sequence and you know that the limit point of this sequence will be zero all right so the limit point of this sequence is what it is zero so singleton zero is only a limit point zero is only a limit point all right so the collection of limit points of this sequence is only singleton zero okay so the now so we will take this sequence is what just i will put n is equal to 1 so i will get 1 n is equal to 2 1 by 2 n is equal to 3 i will get 1 by 3 and so on all right so all the terms of the sequence will be of the form of 1 over n where n belongs to natural number all right so whenever we define a sequence because sequence is a map from n to r therefore n will be a natural number so 1 1 by 2 now if i want to check that zero is a limit point or not okay so there exist a sequence there exist a sequence for example 1 over 2n which is what which is not equal to zero for all n belongs to n dekhiye ye condition true ho rahi hai satisfy ho rahi hai it means that 1 by and limit n tends to infinity 1 by 2n will go to zero therefore zero is a a limit point of what of the set s it means that there exists a sequence such that the sequence is not equal to the limit point itself jo bhi hum limit point check karne ja rahe hain which we are going to check the limit point hai ki nahi hai to wo jo hai कोई भी जो लिमिट पॉइंट होगा वो सीक्वेंस के इक्वल नहीं आना चाहिए इसका मतलब टर्म्स ऑफ द सीक्वेंस में दैट लिमिट पॉइंट शुड नॉट एग्जिस्ट देयर फोर वी विल चूज अ सीक्वेंस व्हिच विल टेंस टू इन जीरो व्हिच विल टेंस टू द लिमिट पॉइंट एज एन टेंस टू इंफिनिटी ऑलराइट सो दिस इज अ सीक्वेंशियल क्राइटेरियन टू टू वेरीफाई दैट अ सर्टेन गिवन पॉइंट इज अ लिमिट पॉइंट और नॉट ऑलराइट you can fail something from this definition also okay so this is all about the sequential criterion of limit.